Okay, welcome back. Back. This is our third be third na ba to? <laughs> I think so. Uh, third video for our uh, topic or chapter centroid. Solving for the centroid and center of gravity of plane uh, areas. So composite areas. So we're, we're, our focus is on composite uh, areas. Okay. So locate the centroid x bar and y bar of the composite area shown in the figure. So this is a bit uh, uh, tricky. Tricky but hindi naman yata masyado. <laughs> so, so for the centroid of this area, so both ano, the, the coordinates uh, x, bar, and y bar since uh, talagang irregular. Irregular ba? Okay. Yung shape natin. Shape na given. Okay. So how do you solve for the same, same principle pa rin? Okay. So let's Nasaan ba yung centroid natin? Maybe it's somewhere here. Let's use the blue one. This is our centroid. May binan dyan siya. No, we don't know. But we will discover later. And then, we have to divide the area into uh, regular uh, sections or areas. Although, imagine na, na obvious naman na yung division, ano? Dito na. So we have this rectangle or ito na lang, rectangle itong buong kuha na yan and we have this triangle no, uh, let me I don't know if it's visible ito na lang yung division natin So, itong rectangle. Okay. Yung buong yan, ha? Huwag yun nang i-separate itong square, no? Ito na lang. Buong yan na lang. Okay. And then, itong isang triangle. Ito, triangle. Right triangle siya. And then, of course, ito. Okay. <laughs> ito, medyo kanto na. So, later on, ang gawin natin para masolve yung area, para hindi masyadong komplikado, ano. Kasi, pwede naman natin gawin pa ng kwan dyan. But you have to solve for this area. Pero ang gawin natin, para simple lang, hindi masyadong komplikado yung computation natin. Uh, this area now is equal to the, uh, is equal to the, difference between uh, itong rectangle and quarter circle. So, subtract lang natin yung area ng rectangle and the area of the quarter circle. That's how we solve for the area of this uh, section of the uh, 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 cross section or area. Okay? So, area 1 natin is yung malaking rectangle. Okay? Let's say this is C1. Centroid niya, somewhere there. Ilan ba ito? So, this C1, area 2 natin, itong right triangle. So, this is uh, C2. Okay. And, uh, yung centroid nito, centroid ng rectangle, tapos, kailangan din natin yung centroid ng quarter circle. So, di ba, subtract natin to later on. So, area ng rectangle minus area ng quarter circle. Sa pag-solve ng centroid niya later on, ng area na, ito, na area na ito, we're just going to subtract now yung ano, yung moment ng area ng rectangle about the x or y axis and yung moment ng area ng quarter circle. So, subtract lang natin yan later on. Okay? So, area ng rectangle, extend na lang natin so that we can uh, solve it. Include it in the analysis. Why? I don't know rectangle somewhere here, you know. Somewhere here. Let's say this is C3. And area ng uh, area. Centroid ng quarter circle. Somewhere here. That is C4. Uh, so let's say na lang. Uh, C3 yung buong rectangle. Ah. And then the 
uh, area 3 yung ano area 3 area 4 naman itong quarter circle okay so itong part na to is just yung area na ito is just the difference between the area of uh, area 3 and area 4 okay ganun lang gawin natin discard it although you can have you can devise other methods whichever you think is more ano uh, uh, appropriate um, appropriate hindi naman appropriate naman ano whichever you think is easier to do but that's how I see it at the moment no impromptu lang <laughs> impromptu yung pag solve natin ng accent itong mga problems okay so hmm, what do we need uh, we need of course the total area the total area is equal to area 1 plus area 2 plus uh, area 3 minus area 4 ano kasi area 3 again I repeat okay area 3 is the area of the rectangle so to get this area we have to subtract yung area 4 which is the area of the quarter circle okay so let's do that so area 1 is 3 inches Dito. yung we have 3 inches times uh, yung length ng rectangle natin or base ng rectangle natin is 3 plus 4 plus 3 kasi 3 inches to ah Baka, kasi yun yung radius na ano so this is uh, 3 inches din yan so that is 3 plus 3 6 plus 4 is 10 inches okay all right. <coughs> Sorry. Plus uh, area two that is area of a triangle, so that is one half. Uh, base natin is three inches. Uh, height natin is also three inches, no? Plus area three natin is the tung rectangle that is four plus three, that is seven inches times yung height natin na. 3 inches and of course we have to subtract the area of the quarter circle and the area of quarter circle the area of circle divided by 4 you know? so pi r squared r is 3 inches all over uh, 4 since uh, i-divide natin yung area ng circle by 4 okay so this would be the total area okay okay uh the area is 48.431 square inches. Let me double check para hindi magkamali. Okay, okay na. Um, uh, anong gusto nyong unahin natin na isolve? Yung X bar or Y bar? <laughs> uh, let's solve for the uh, X bar since we have been solving for Y bar for the previous, you know, previous video. So ito yung X bar natin. That's the X coordinate of the centroid. X bar ito. Okay? Okay. X bar. X bar. Ito naman yung Y bar natin. Yan naman yung Y bar. Okay. So first we need to solve. We have to solve for the value of X bar or the X coordinate. Again, so we have yung uh, principle natin, yung moment ng total area relative to y-axis is equal to the summation of moments of each individual areas about the y-axis. So let's do that. So the total area is 48.431 square inches times its moment arm about uh, y-axis, which is uh, x-bar, obviously equals yung moment ng area 1 to y axis. So what is area 1? Kailangan yung area 1. Idiretso natin dito, wag natin i-solve individually yung area. Idiretso natin sa equation. So area 1 is ito. 3 inches by 10 inches times 
So, yung distance ng center ng area 1 to y axis. So, remember, this is a rectangle. So, ito, papunta doon. So, half nyan. So, 10 nyan, ano? Half is 5 inches. Okay? So, I repeat this distance. Distance ng C1 to y axis. Okay? Plus, C2. Papunta dun sa y-axis. So, moment ng C2, area 2, about the y-axis. So, what is area 2? Area ng triangle. So, 1 half, 3 inches by 3 inches. So, distance naman ng C2 and y-axis. So, how do, you, how do you determine the distance of C2 from the y-axis? So, remember, eto... This is <clears throat> B over 3. Yan ay B over 3 papunta dun. Ito naman, H over 3. Ayan, H over 3 yan. Okay? I hope that is visible sa video. So, which means that itong distance na to, C2 papunta dun, is itong distance na yan. That is 2 thirds of B. Itong distance na yan. Okay? Two-thirds of B. Uh, base is 3 inches. So, two-thirds of uh, 3. Ilagyan na lang natin dito. Two-thirds of 3 inches. Or that is actually uh, 2, ano? 2 inches. So, uh, kinumpeto ko na lang para mas maintindihan natin in sa discussion. Okay? So, two-thirds of B yan ha, yung base natin. And this is uh, H over 3 or one-third of H. Ayan. Okay? Okay na tayo? Doon sa C2, ano? Malinaw yan. Next. <clears throat> Plus, uh, I should put it here. Ah, ito na lang. Plus, itong, again, yung buong rectangle. So, Plus, Area na rectangle, that is 7 inches by 3 inches times its moment arm, yung center ng third, ng, ng area 3, papunta doon sa y-axis, distance nyan. So, take note, this is uh, 7 inches yung length nyan, divided by 2, that's uh, 3.5 plus 3, okay? So, this is 3.5 plus 3, that is 6.5 inches. Okay? So, C3 to Y axis is 6.5 inches. Okay? And then, of course, since uh, naasali yung uh, quarter circle dun sa pag-solve natin sa area ng rectangle, we have to remove that. So, minus to. Minus yung area ng quarter circle Yung moment ng ear ng quarter circle about the y axis. So we have area of a quarter circle. So pi 3 inches square divided by 4 times ano naman yung moment arm na ito. Papunta dun. So this is C4 to y axis. So remember this is ano naman to? Anong distance ito? Parehas lang siya sa distance na yan. Sa formula natin. So, formula natin, let's try to remember. Okay? So, remember natin yung centroid ng quarter circle. Ito yung centroid ng quarter circle natin. That is 4R over 3 pi. So, remember, ito yun ha. Na distance. Hindi ito. But ito, na distance is 4R over 3 pi. The same din yun dito as 4R over 3 pi. So, this is 4R over 3 pi. This is also 4R over 3 pi. So, which means that this distance, itong distance na ito, hmm, dapat maintindihan yung buti ito, ah. So, this means that yung distance na to, kasi yun yung kailangan natin, kasi para mas masolve yung distance ng C4 punta sa Y, 
which means this distance is just r minus 4r over 3 pi. Okay? This distance is r, itong buong yan, minus 4r over 3 pi. Pero din dito. Because we need this one later on din. So why bad naman? This is r minus 4r over uh, 3 pi. Okay? I, th I, I hope that is uh, clear. Okay, so, ilagay natin yan. So, bracket na lang ang kuhan natin dito. So, that is 7 inches. No, yung distance ng C4 to Y. So, 3 plus 4, that is 7 inches. Plus, itong distance na yan, R. Ano yung R natin? Uh, 3 inches minus 4R over 3 pi. 4, 3 inches over 3 pi. Okay? So, that's it. Medyo mahaba yung equation natin, but it's uh, pretty simple. Ayan. Okay? Now, we have one unknown in the equation, and that is x bar. So, sabi sa problem, x bar is 4.83 uh, inches. We'll see later on. Uh, solve natin yung x bar. So, the answer is uh, x bar is equal to 4.828 uh, inches. Or that is, uh, parehas lang doon, it's two decimal places lang kasi itong nilagay na sagot dito. But it's actually 4.828 inches. Okay? That is uh, X bar. Okay. I hope that is clear. Okay. Uh, next, uh, we solve for Y bar naman. Y bar. Okay, so the same principle pa rin naman. Uh, Mag-moment lang tayo dito sa may x-axis. Okay? So yung area, total area times y bar is equal to summation of a times y. Okay? So total area, we have solved this a while ago. Hmm. That is, actually parehas lang, mag-iiba lang ay yung mga moment arms no moment arms ang mag-iiba okay yan pero ilagay na lang natin lahat-lahat ulit so we have area that is 48.431 square inches times y bar yung unknown Ta uh, equals so again let's start with area 1 area 1 this time uh, ito ah, C1 to X na ngayon na kanina C1 to Y axis now C1 to X axis okay so area 1 yung rectangle uh, ito maling rectangle that is 10 inches times 3 inches okay so parehas na doon ang mag -iba lang is yung moment arm niya okay so distance ng C1 to x axis naman c1 to x axis hmm. so this is 3 inches no so since rectangle yan half lang nun yung ito c1 from the base so that is 1.5 inches again c1 to x axis plus uh, dun tayo sa c2 so area ng area 2 uh, triangle, so one half three inches times three inches. Yung moment arm naman niya, so C2 to X axis. C2 to X axis. Ayan. So we have three inches plus H over three. Mm -hmm. So three inches plus h over 3. Ano yung h over 3 natin? Ito yung height ng triangle. 
uh, 3 inches, 3 divided by 3, so h over 3, that is 1 inch, or that is 4 inches yeah. Okay? Oh, malinaw yun. Plus, itong tri ah, tri <laughs> rectangle, uh, area 3 naman tayo. So, area 3, that is 7 inches times 3 inches times C3 to X axis. So, C3 to X axis. Okay, so we have 3 inches plus ito, 3 inches yan, plus ito, distance na to. So, 3 inches ito, divided by 2, obviously this is 1.5 inches ito. Okay? Huh. Okay, minus. Since nasali kanina yan, yung quarter circle sa pag-solve ng itong area 3, we have to remove it. So, minus area ng quarter circle, that is pi 3 squared over 4 times, na naman tayo, <laughs> C4 to X axis. C4 to X axis. Anong distance yan? It is 3 inches plus ito. So, 3 inches plus this one. This one is R minus 4R over 3 pi. Kasi nga, yung 4R over 3 pi, yung distance na yan. Ito yung kailangan natin na distance. So, we have R, ito, yung buo, minus 4R over 3 pi. So, 3 inches... Plus R R, ano yung R? Uh, 3 inches Minus 4 R over 3 pi So 4, 3 Over 3 pi Dalawang okay. beses ko nang ginamit yung parenthesis hmm. Ayan Okay na I hope na klaro yun And then You can now solve for Y bar so, solve for y bar. Okay, so the answer is 2.562 inches. Okay? So, yung coordinates natin, yung coordinates ng centroid natin is, uh, yung x bar, x coordinate natin is 4.828 inches. And y bar natin, oh my goodness. So, for <laughs> di pa nakikita sa video. So, yung coordinate ng centroid natin is x, x coordinate, x bar, 4.828. And y coordinate is y bar, so it is 2.562 uh, inches. So, yan yung coordinates ng centroid ng area na ito. Okay? I hope klaro yung uh, explanation or discussion natin. Okay, in case you have questions, uh, you can always uh, message me sa messenger. Alright, so we'll have another example. Uh, separate video na lang. Okay?